We are so excited. Thank you for joining us today. We have a huge announcement and I am going to let Gusty share our great news. So thank oh, you. Oh yeah. Awesome, Jenny. Thank you. Well, um, it is my absolute pleasure to introduce and welcome my friend, the president of the Birmingham Association of Realtors, uh, David and Peggy Lucas to EXP Realty. Yay! Welcome aboard. <laughs> I'm so, so excited. Well, excited. we're all excited. We um, have been uh, waiting. We've grown so much here in Birmingham and we were looking for, um, Izzy just said, yes. <laughs> um, on the call. Right now. <laughs> um, we've been waiting uh, uh, for some additional leadership because our growth has just been phenomenal here in Birmingham. And uh, we're just so happy and proud for you to be here. Well, we, we're, we're happy and proud to be here. Uh, now, this has been great. It's, uh, it's been an interesting move, been an interesting transition, uh, uh, merging in a company and, and, uh, and looking for the new chapters to move on to. It's, it's, it's been great. Uh, it's, it is definitely something that we're, that we're overly excited about. And, and really, for us, this, uh, this was a great fit. It had, uh, it had the technology. It had the, the uh, and everybody knows that, that I kind of like to take a vacation every now and then and travel. So, uh, so it had the flexibility in order to go all over the country and still be able to be working and everything. And of course, Peggy likes to work and, and travel at the same time. So it, it really fit what we were doing and just the group of people uh, to be in business with is, is fantastic. And I really think that, that our, that EXP Realty, especially throughout the state of Alabama, but more importantly in the central Alabama area, which is what we're going to broker and cover, is uh, is destined for a lot of growth, a lot of growth, a lot of phenomenal people. And uh, we're looking forward. Well, we're so glad you're here and uh, we get to work together again. So it has been quite some time that uh, we got to share leadership roles side by side and uh, happy for that and happy that Peggy being a top producing agent gets to earn all the benefits that EXP has. I'm just so happy for y'all as um, as a company um, because you also uh, brought uh, your you rolled your company into EXP. Hello. Yes, 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 we did. Yes. Uh, you know, the, the, it lit up quicker than I could hit the mute button there. Uh, <laughs> but yes, we did. We were able, we we wrote in, uh, uh, you know, uh, the Lucas and Associates people with us, and then uh, super excited, super excited for that one. And Peggy even told me the other day she goes, you know, she's claimed for the last eleven years she's never received a paycheck. So now now she gets to take now she gets to get her own check. So we're happy check. with that one. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh well, one of the big things is, um, you know, there's uh, with EXP in the state of Alabama, there's been some, uh, you know, changes. Uh, Brent Beavers has been our designated managing broker. And so as part of you coming on board, bringing over Lucas and Associates to uh, to EXP, there's there's some brokerage uh, broker changes in our market. Do you want to talk about that? Sure, absolutely. Uh, one of the things was is EXP, when they first came into the market, uh, they had one broker per state and what what has been known now is that with the massive growth that has occurred we have to we have to start looking at it from how to best serve not only the consumer but also the agent consumer that's within the company and so uh what we've done now is we've regionalized uh the the, the uh, brokers of exp uh we have a northern uh regional broker who is Holly Moody, and then we have a, a, a southern regional broker who is also our designated managing broker, uh, who is Kelly Colley, and then and then myself. I'm going to be the central uh, regional broker for uh, for the company, and which will cover uh, pretty much from uh, from Blount County through Chilton County, and from Mississippi to Georgia. We're there, and uh, even though. Real estate has no boundaries, and EXP truly has no no geographic boundaries when it comes to to the collaborative nature of the company. Uh, we still have that uh, that ability to to service the areas of which we are very familiar with and have a lot of uh, a, a lot of time invested in. And I think that that's going to be uh, one of our elements for even greater growth. There's going to be the aspect of 
of the more localized broker aspect of it, I think will be a, a greater benefit for our agents involved. Yeah, I completely agree. And, and I'll tell you, we've seen so much growth, uh, th not only throughout the state of Alabama, but but locally here in Birmingham has been spectacular growth. You know, a year ago, uh, EXP had a little under 1% market share. Um, earlier this week, I looked and EXP is at 4.1% market share year to date. Um, and that is uh, and, and homes sold in our market. I know y'all, your group has another percent market share. So with with y'all rolling in and and just some, you know, kind of I've been hearing about some other folks that are definitely uh, uh, considering making the move over to EXP in our market. We are well on our way to one of our favorite goals. What is that, Jenny? <laughs> 25 by 25. That's right. <laughs> And uh, I want to get, get take just a minute. Um, Brent Beavers, we love you. Um, he just joined in and said, hey, oh, David and team, um, very excited um, to, to have you here. So thank you, Brent. Um, we love everything that you've done for us and everything that um, you have supported us through for sure to get here. So, um, but we are excited, right? Uh, David, you, um, y'all have an office that yes. also so share with us you know where that location is oh yeah yeah we uh, uh we maintained our our space over here in river chase so uh we're over here off uh off chase park south 100 chase park south uh the xp sign went on the door I yesterday the door. on the door yesterday and uh uh so for for our for our team here in the in the, in the central alabama area uh we have uh we have a meeting room we have training facilities we have uh, desk space if folks need to drop in and do some stuff on this end of town and you just need to, to get something done or meet someone uh, you know because for me you know you guys know that I deal a lot in agent safety and so for me uh, a place for our people to like that is kind of like the home turf uh, is very important so with doing that we we've, we've got office space over here and uh, and you know we welcome everybody to come in and and uh, uh, and if you need us, we're here. Come see us. Well, um, Peggy was telling me that you have a 40-person uh, training room and uh, that we can easily social distance there very responsibly and uh, take advantage of um, some good training sessions. So I know that um, you're an excellent instructor um, and uh, we'll be definitely getting together, I'm sure, and have a lot of use for that office. Ab absolutely. The, the, we have large training space. It's almost a, uh, with 2020 has forced us to turn it into almost a TV studio. I mean, we can we, we can Zoom broadcast and uh, uh, everything else with it. But yeah, we got plenty of space to spread folks out, and and that's one of the big things for me was was you know I I appreciate the fact on that EXP is is virtual and that we can do a lot through EXP University and all the training and the phenomenal you know 50 plus classes this week alone on just uh, learning about the the aspects and facets of real estate. But you know, then again, there's always that plus side to if you wanted to have that that in that live in person aspect. We've got that ability. We can, like I said, we can host forty you know forty people and socially distance them, plus put them on Zoom, and we can get you know we can, we can 150, 200 people. So the the reach is there. The avenue is there. Um, so we are hugely excited about it. I mean, for us, it's just a matter of uh, the last the last couple of weeks have been quiet. Um, you know, we, we have to make sure we don't say anything and, and we don't do anything that we're not supposed to do while we're, while we're trying to get everything done because we were trying to get stuff done with the state and everything. And, and we got that handled and we're, we got a few more transitional things to take care of uh, on the local levels to get all that handled. But, uh, but it's going to be exciting. I really, really see this being the next big move. I mean, they, we've crossed over 35,000 agents, you know, uh, we the potential to be at over 40,000 agents by the end of the year is there. It's now a matter of how we get there. And so, you know, we're on, we're on that sprint right now to, to try to close out a quarter. Well, I always knew that this was going to be a good fit for the two of you um, the business model because of, you know, what we've done in the past and what you understand and how you like to work. Um, I knew you would end up loving it. And we were in pre-licensed class together the day that my license transferred. <laughs> 
And I was super quiet because it is there's such a fear factor, especially then because it was so new. So I didn't tell. Well, Kimberly was sitting next to me, so I told her, but um, I was like super quiet. (laughs) <laughs> that whole time. But it's so great now to fast forward and see that you're here with us, both of you. Um, that's very, very exciting. Uh, we have some people, uh, Travis in Montgomery, and he said, wow. Uh, Drew Wilder at Lake Martin said, welcome. And uh, Paula uh, Reed says, welcome. Mm-hmm. She's here in Birmingham. And Austin's in Gadsden. And he says, excited to have you with EXP. This is so awesome. So, oh, fantastic. Um, <laughs> oh. Yeah, I, I was going to say, I've had the honor and the privilege to get to work with two currently and several over the last uh, probably three months EXP agents, the the caliber of, of agent and their co-oping skills to, to get the client into the home and be happy and content and it's not an adversarial situation. The level of professionalism of the EXP agents is phenomenal and it's been an honor and a privilege and Izzy, we're getting to the closing on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I adore Izzy. I love her so much. So whenever she heard the news, I guess you had told her, um, she called me immediately and said how excited she was. So I, I told her, I said, I couldn't tell you when you were telling me how much you loved Peggy. <laughs> well, that's, that, that's, that's the funny thing is, you know, over the last couple of weeks, you know, there, there have been those questions like, hey, I've heard. <laughs> and I'm like, no, not that I know of. I, 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 no. <laughs> Uh, even early on, I mean, I was asked, uh, uh, you know, because we we told we you know we told our, our group here. I said, you know, this was this was not something that 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 I went looking for. That this came to us. You know, the good you know the Lord puts things that to puts us where we need to be. Yeah. And and so I was like, you know, okay, you know, this is this is something that's. I mean, I repainted the office. You know. I think it's funny that you know, new flooring repainted the office, and then and then now we we, we get into a, a an organization that's 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 largely virtual, and I'm like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but those who, want, yeah. those who want to come and and, and have some space and and, and do the in office thing is that we have it for you. Um, we have not only the training room, we also have conference rooms with flat screen TVs so that they can throw the MLS up on the television and present to their clients while they're here before they go out to showings and just everyone's welcome. Well, there are lots of agents that um, this will be very exciting for them for that aspect of it, um, that they do want to go to an office. Um, I was always an office person until I joined and I've winged myself off all of that. But um, I know that we like to get together. Uh, Last Lunch and Learn we did, we had over 42 people. And uh, just of our local Birmingham agents, and actually some drove from Montgomery up to participate and some drove from Lake Martin. So uh, we have such a connected group and you <laughs> you might get a little, you know, Paula's like, yes, me. <laughs> <laughs> y'all might get a little sick of seeing us just because well, you, I mean, you know, the, the connect- I, I did my onboarding, you know, at, uh, for, for broker ops, I, I did it at home. And so I can't work from home because apparently the dog is not a good sweet mate. Uh, <laughs> he, he has the tendency to want to be overly needy while you're there. So, uh, so I'll be in the office uh, virtually and uh, physically, uh, you know, Monday through Friday. So unless, well, unless of course it's pretty and you know, 75 degrees in golf. Weather. Game, if won't. we can get a golf game, yeah, that probably won't happen. But still, we're going to be here. Uh, so we are. I mean, this is going to be. Um, it already is, and I can tell that moving forward, this is just going to be such a tremendous journey that it, it, it has everything that, that we can supply to the agents in our area that will help them grow their business. And at the end of the day, as a broker, uh, which you, you know, you and I have been there before, and, and it's, as, a, as, as a broker, your job is to first supervise, of course, according to the state of Alabama. But the second thing, though, is to is to grow. You've got, you know, your people have to grow. And I think that's my big, uh, uh, I think that's my big thing, is that I want to make sure that, that I've always maintained the philosophy that you have to have a positive influence on people's lives. And so in doing that, I think that, that being able just to have the, the productivity grow, the agent count grow, the the overall aspect of the organization grow 
in a positive manner, I think is vitally important. Well, it is. And uh, you've always poured into agents and their growth in the past. Um, both of you have. Um, and we have noticed a trend that when people do join us, their business does go up because we have certain things within the business model that motivate people. Like Chad Beasley says, I'm showing in areas I've never shown. <laughs> I haven't shown in years. <laughs> you know, he wanted a cap and then get to that icon award. And then he hit double diamonds. So, um, uh, we have so many things already built in to help motivate. And then with your help and leadership and everything that Gusty and I do, um, we're just very thankful for everybody um, and their role that they play. So over here, Vicki Harris says, I am so happy. Welcome. Brittany Moore says, welcome, Dave, David. Super excited to have you join us. So, um, and I think Brent is up for that golf game with y'all. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Hey, you know, I, I, you know, going through this process, you were able to really, um, you know, dive into more about the EXP model. What were some of the other things that that really excited the excited y'all, and um, that also for your agents that you think is uh, really unique about EXP? From an agent's perspective, um, having owned the company with David and and being, we used to call it being on our island. We were very social we would go to everything david being the president of the association he would get out and about but when you're by yourself and you're not a part of something as large as what exp offers both in training marketing branding yourself i love 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 the fact that exp encourages each and every agent to brand themselves under the support and umbrella of exp's power and um that's huge for me because i've been doing this 22 years and i've always from day one branded myself and we're not on that island any longer. We have a lot of folks to get out and um, talk with, reconnect with, take part in the online uh, support that you offer. It's, it, I don't want to use the word overwhelming. It's, it's, it's welcomed in my world to be able to have so much information that I can go and pick and see what fits me. And I can go out and pick up a training here and there. The other thing for me was, um, I'm getting older. I've been doing this for 22 years and to be able to have an opportunity to not just share what I do and what I know with agents, but to be able to bring in other people into the EXP world and the way that they financially benefit everyone and to create a, a stream of income beyond your commissions into your retirement to me now that I'm older, because when I was younger, I didn't think about it. But it gets here pretty quick, and um, it's, it's, it is something that's very unique and real for people to have. It is, and you're going to love it. So I think I miss George. George, we love you. Um, he said, this is huge, and huge. now we're waiting on you. <laughs> <laughs> I know my, I'm getting text messages over here, so this is, this is fantastic. So, um, you know, I, I just it, – it's um, – you know, when we rolled in our brokerage about a year ago, you know, there's just so much, you know, to think about. And and you've got, you know, here, there, everywhere, you know, trying to, you know, get everything connected with the real estate commission. And it's a lot. And y'all built a very successful real estate brokerage over an 11 year period. Y'all had a um, your team leaders at another company. Um, so y'all are, um, you know, just you know how to build brokerages, you know how to build businesses. Um, you are leaders, not only in the community, but it, within the agent community. And, and that's what I'm, you know, one of the pieces I think I'm so excited about the most is being able to um, work with people that I've always really wanted to work hand in hand with. I can now truly be in business with them under this model. Right. It really wouldn't have made sense under brick or, you know, if, 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 if I was somewhere else, but at EXP, we can all collaborate together and we can all celebrate everyone's wins. And I think one of the cool things about what y'all are about to see is the amount of collaboration, not only locally, but worldwide. It's, it's really impressive. And it's been one of the, the biggest wow uh, things that I've ran into wow. that has been big for me. Yeah, well, you know, that, exactly. I mean, my, my thing was is that, you know, someone uh, I was asked recently, you know, in the last couple of days, so you're, you're, so you're closing Lucas and Associates. And I went, no, no, that's, that's not really what is happening here. I said, I said, we are joining forces with 
a larger organization. I mean, because uh, like Pinky said, you know, as an independent brokerage, uh, you're on an island and and you can you can grow a lot, but you're only going to grow to the size of the island. And or, or to the size of your of what you can do personally. Yes. Yes. That's that's the key. I mean, you know, for many, many years since 2009, for the majority of that time, I was the broker, the uh, accountant, tech support. the tech support, <laughs> uh, the trainer and, uh, and all, all things combined. And so it was funny the other day when when uh, when I'm in our our, uh, our Alabama brokers meeting and they're introducing me to the staff and I'm this, this one person does this and this person does this and this person does this. And then in my head, I'm going, well, I did that. Well, I did that. Well, I did that. Oh, but I don't have to do that anymore. This is wonderful. Uh, but I will say this, though, you were talking about what did I learn during, during the onboarding training aspect of it was uh, first off. Uh, you should be required as a broker to go through uh, onboarding through EXP uh, at least three times because it's information through a fire hose. And <laughs> uh, you, you miss it, and then you're sitting there after it's over with, and you're going, they mentioned something about this, and I don't remember why. So uh, so going through that, but uh, but it has been, I tell you what, though, since I got away from the, the EXP world, uh, the master onboarding with, with the company onboarding and got more local, got in with our Alabama group, phenomenal group between Kelly and Holly uh, and, and, and our, the, the staff on the local level, uh, statewide level is phenomenal. These are a great group of people and highly knowledgeable and great at what they do. Uh, I would send a question in to, to someone with agent services and Anita would send me something back going, okay, here you go. This is it. This is what you need. And so it's great. And, I think that uh, over the next over the next week or so, we get settled in. We get uh, we get our we get our virtual and our human feet under us, and and we start running. We start we start going with it. I mean, that is probably the biggest thing. I'm not waiting. I wrote my uh, first contract last night. <laughs> I'm <laughs> I may I may have to talk with paper compliance. <laughs> Just gain enough load. <laughs> You're That's right. Good. And George, I mean, that was the thing. You know, she walks in and she says, "Hey, um, she goes, I'm already because see, my wife left me. Uh, just so y'all know, uh, uh, the other day she just left my she just left the brokerage and went to this other company, and uh, <laughs> and so it was like, I'm like, wow, that was just okay. Uh, and then the other side of me went, well, now she's gone. So, uh, but anyway, uh, but." The fun, you know, the great thing is, is that yes, yeah, she, you know, Peg's hit it right. She's knocking it out. Most of, a lot of, a lot of the folks that are that are transitioning over are already working contracts, things of that nature, and uh, that's why I said over the next week or so, when we get, when we really get the square footing down, it's it's time to go. We we mm -hmm. it's it's time to take this beyond where we think we can go to places that make us real uncomfortable to get there. And I think that's the great thing is, you know, uh, uh, there was the, uh, there was a phrase that was utilized one time. Uh, there's, there's no, there's no, there's no such thing as stable. You know, if you're stay, you can, you're either growing or you're dying and stable's never good. So we're growing. It's, it's time to get it and go. And so I really believe that, that 12 months from now, we can have this conversation again and the numbers are going to be through the roof. I well, think we'll be close to ten percent market share by then. Yes, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> well, and I think that this it has been um, one of the missing pieces because we've had such growth so quickly that um, I think it's going to um, be so well received that um, we have a broker right here in uh, Birmingham. So um, we're excited about that. And um, George says, "Yeah, that one man island thing is getting all." At George. I've already said it. We're waiting on you, man. You know, I love you. Well, George and I have the exact same birthday. Um, so, you know, we are um, brothers from different mothers. <laughs> We're twins. Well, now, Brent, Brent, Brent's different. exactly right with the CEO and chief bottle washer guy, too. There goes. Uh, you know, that was, uh, I, uh, we, we, when we remodeled the office, I got rid of this big old desk that we'd had since 2009. And, and I knew I was in trouble when, 
when uh, when Wayfair delivered it in two boxes and 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 the uh, the instruction manual looked like yeah. the uh, the old encyclopedia and I'm like mm, I should have paid for that to put together. Mm -hmm. so, but that's the whole thing is that that this is this is a launch. This is this is the ability to take the steps. I mean, it's it's like everyone in EXP and and I'm I'm going to uh, say especially in the central region. You know, the central in the central branch is going to be. We, it, let's go. We, it's it's time to start. It's time, time to start taking the numbers, growing the numbers, growing the share, and and growing the businesses of the people in our organization. The collaboration between agents, the the ones that are coming with us uh, to EXP from Lucas and Associates, are so excited to be able to mastermind and to just get a new vein, a new vein of energy from a different direction, a different. You know, how do you do this? Just a different perspective and to actually share ours as well with 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 others. So well, y'all have so much wonderful um, knowledge and experience to share, too. So we're, we're all going to be better off because of it. So um, and, and one of the things like being on that one man island that you'll know, like I know what that's like, because you're like I am, David, where you'll take on all the responsibility. I'll do it. Just add it to my list. Yes, I'll take care of it. And you'll stay up and, you know, do the work of 12 people. Um, and uh, we've got this new Accelerate training program. And I put the outline together. Gusty put a stamp on it and, you know, helped me figure out what the missing pieces were. And I don't have to teach it every day. No. I mean, we have top producing givers that when you can learn from Chad Beasley, like how to put a listing in, like how to go explain a listing um, a, a document, a listing agreement. And um, all of our people stay, you know, step forward and give and contribute. And you don't have to be that one person anymore. We're all here together. I mean, if somebody can learn like, you know, from Gusty how to do a home inspection contingency removal. I mean, it is exactly. awesome the kind of training that we get here. And of course it's in our own group. And um, I hope that you don't mind me um, bringing up one little thing and, uh, uh, <laughs> yes, Austin, thank you. Um, there were some misconceptions, so many misconceptions about our company. And uh, you just don't know until you know. You got to figure it out and kind of want to know. Um, and one of those things is that I heard yesterday is that because um, we have different organizations and sponsors within our group and, um, uh, you know, Gusty and I are aligned together and we have like a fantastic organization throughout the state and other states that a lot of people think that you're just the broker for our group. <laughs> yeah, that'd be a lot easier. Uh, <laughs> it, it would be great if I was, uh, you know, only the broker for a small group. Uh, but that's not the way life is. No. Nope. Um, I will be the broker of right now, probably sitting at close to 260, 270 people, uh, which means we will have a lot of structure uh, because you know, uh, and, and that's I, I guess that's that's where my strong suit is is the. Uh, is the the actual management aspect of it because i've been so which you know i've been so involved uh you know with training through the real estate commission and through the association and things of that nature that that you know the funny thing was is that that there was uh you know you have to kind of explain to people that you know, you have influencers throughout any organization but then at the end of the day you've got the members of an organization and that's how the organization grows and runs and and so uh, to to kill the rumor, to kill the uh, to kill the myth, uh, uh, you know, this is uh, I'm the, I'm the guy responsible. I'm I'm the guy that's going to be you know responsible for the 260 70 plus people right now. There'll be more uh, in in the central Alabama region. And the the thing is is that um, it's not no no one works for someone. Everyone works together, and that's the key. Because uh, now there, there, there's one, you know, you you can do your own business, and you can do it the way that you that you want to grow your business. But 
uh, no one succeeds alone. I mean, I am not sitting where I am today without the lady with me. I mean, that's just, you heard you know, that, you know, my, and I'm saying it live, you know, my it is recorded bride. and live. Yeah. Yeah. My, my beautiful brides, you know, the, you know, well, she is the reason I'm sitting here. I mean, actually, uh, cause when I retired from law enforcement, she told me that I wasn't going to get to sit at home. So I had that going for me. Um, but, but that's the thing is that, you know, there wasn't, there was, it has been, and even when I was going through, there was this miss, you know, this miss, uh, perception that, that was a couple of few people in Birmingham and that was it and that's not true this is a large organization and we have many outstanding uh agents in the central region well and not just from central Alabama David and I doing this as long as we both have been doing it have contacts and connections and referral agents and great relationships with people all over the United States that after this came in our radar, it's kind of like buying a car. You didn't see it or think it on the street until you bought it yourself. And then I, you know, connecting with people in social media and, and folks that we have gone through branding and marketing all these years, they're already in EXP. And I thought, wow, this is another great way to be able to reconnect with those same people all over that we've shared great ideas with all, the, all of our real estate life. Yeah, and you're going to expand that immediately. So it, it's fun. Like this time last year, we were in Las Vegas and meeting so many new people in our network. And uh, we'll be able to do that again once COVID gets gone. <laughs> but um, Brent made such a great point. He said, Glenn Sanford said from day one, let's build a brokerage that it would be irresponsible for agents to hang their license elsewhere. Oh, and yeah. I read that at the very, I went to the New Orleans EXP con and I was ducking in and out of classes, telling people, please don't take a picture of me. <laughs> and just cause I was learning about it and I just didn't want people to be, you know, rumors spread so quickly, you know that. Um, uh, when I read that, I, I, that, that completely had me in um, just because I, I believe in that myself. And I feel like, um, you know, we're, we're doing everything we can to contribute to that ideal. So, uh, so an interesting thing is I was, I, uh, I was described this way the other day. So I'll just put it out here. So everybody knows from the, uh, from, from our world looking in that uh, uh, the statement was made that uh, uh David protects his people first, and if then if he needs to, he'll correct his people, and that's his that's his thing. And I'm like, well, yeah, that kind of works. I'm, you know, my I I, I told an, I told a young agent one time that called me about one of my people. I I, I said I bite first, so whatever you got to say, make sure you understand. I'm gonna come back at you, but after that, we'll work it out. And we did, so that was a good thing. Uh, but. But I truly just uh, like like Peggy was saying, you know, now 2020 is on me, unfortunately. Um, so I mean, we will miss EXP Con live, uh, which is bad. Uh, but still, uh, but it's I, I just see Brent, I just saw Brent, Brent just uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, Brent just said uh, 585 agents in Alabama as of this morning. I yeah, mean, that's huge. You know, we're we're we're, we're going to knock a thousand out in a hurry, guys. We're we're just going to knock it out and be done with it. Yep. Yep. I also like yep. the interior referral network. Like if I need to send something to Montgomery or to sub south further, even down into the beach or whatever, I don't have to spend an hour and a half trying to find somebody that is a designation that I'd appreciate handling my clients and customers and, and to know it's a, literally at your phone fingertips. Oh, the, the, the workplace, the work, uh, workplace app is, is phenomenal. I mean, you know, the, the different groups that are in there, that you can utilize and and help you know and like the, there's a you know referral out you know areas there's there's all of these things in there that that typically aren't available unless you go through corporate and this is just like I was on there the other day and you go through the uh, uh, the workplace app and you can you can refer you know just I need I need a buyer's agent in Phoenix and someone will someone somebody will message you so that that internal workings is, is phenomenal. I can speak firsthand that um, I've been with several different companies and I have already closed and made more money with uh, internal referrals with EXP than I have any other uh, national brand. 
um, it is amazing. It's 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 really uh, refreshing, and uh, you know you're you're seeing it now, but Peggy's really going to see it when she starts. <laughs> Well, she has to work hard to, you know, keep me in the lifestyle I've grown accustomed. So there's that. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Well, I, I know a bunch of people have been, uh, you know, watching and uh, been waiting for a, a big announcement. And, uh, you know, I just I'm thrilled to be in business with you all. I'm thrilled to, uh, you know, see what's even going to happen over this next three months, because I know y'all's phones are going to blow up. Uh, of people that, you know, I know a lot of people have been sitting on the sideline watching EXP and watching what we've been doing over the last year. I know I, I watched for two years on the sidelines. And so, you know, when you've got people of the caliber of David and Peggy and, and their Lucas and Associates teams coming to EXP, it makes you seriously look at EXP. And, and I, you know, the, we, we've got the saying is once you see it, you can't unsee it. Oh yeah, that's right. Very true. You're very true on that one. So, well, um, so excited to be partnered with y'all. Um, I, I, my phone's been going off the hook. <laughs> wow, so pumped! Um, and so I know y'all's. Uh, you're going to be answering a lot of messages here pretty soon. So uh, I can finally put it on Facebook now. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> She was, you she was changing her employment status earlier and she goes she was trying to she was I, she asked me about something and and i walked away and then i sat here at the desk for a second i went oh wait she's not changing that now is she so i sent her a message i didn't want to walk back down the hallway my office I, is six <laughs> inches away in the sheetrock wall and he sends me a text message i said you're not changing you're not changing now are you my kids do the same thing at home she was like no we're not changing i'm not changing now i'm just waiting <laughs> Well, now everybody knows. We're super excited about this, and uh, we're very grateful for being in the right place at the right time with the right group of people that were open and receptive to a wonderful opportunity that's just going to explode. Exp. And um, <laughs> timing does have to be right for for everyone. It, does. it had to be right for you one to see it, one for the opportunity to come available. And um, so, uh, and when timing is right, it's a beautiful thing. So um, before we wrap up, because this is just such a great day, um, you know, let's address and Gusty, you can specifically address this that. Um, you know, when you have to keep things quiet, because like you said, you were protecting uh, the people that were in that whole situation. And um, I know that that's very hard when you're asked direct questions. Gusty, you know, firsthand yep. when you're asked direct questions. Are you going to do this? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah it's kind of like like saving, like leaving Miami, you know, for for Tuscaloosa. Uh, <laughs> but it's, you know, it's, it's, it's difficult because, you know, when you, when you have your name on the door, you, when you have agents that, that you represent, you know, your job is to put them in the best position possible. And, um, you know, it's, uh, it's very, very difficult and, and you have to walk a really fine line. And, uh, you know, what I, what I love about David and Peggy is they, they have such a great team um, that, you know, their folks, um, you know, their folks are really uh, are, they look at their, uh, their folks as mentees and they've done a fantastic job of coaching them and they just, you know, their mentees believe in them. Their agents believe in them, and that's why we're seeing so many of them come over. And so I'm really excited about that. And um, but it's tough. You gotta you gotta keep it quiet, and you know uh, sometimes that that does hurt feelings. Um, but you know it just you know you're presenting them with a better opportunity, and uh, and that's hard for leaders. Uh, you know sometimes we have to take a step back, and and um, but we're always trying to put our agents in the best position possible, and so. That's what we did with rolling in our brokerage, and I have the same feeling that that's what you've done with uh, with with merging as well. Absolutely, I mean, you just you 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 go into it, and you 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 have the faith that when you come out the other side of it, it'll be where it should be and how it should be. And and to us, that was it. You know, it was uh, like I said, we 
you know, we were placed in this position. Uh, it was presented, and and now we're on the other side of it. So how we came, how we how we got from there from there to here is 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 from today forward irrelevant. Now it's we're through the other side, Building and now up. it's time to go. Right. Love it, love it. <laughs> oh, good. Well, we're gonna have so much fun. Thank you all so much. Thanks for having us on. Thanks for today. having us on. Yes, absolutely. I hope it was a good enough surprise. There we go. It was, it was fantastic. And I'm going to be at the Hoover office tomorrow, by the way. There you go. Bring it. <laughs> no donuts. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> right. I still got like 22 days left, and guess you'll understand what the, all that's about. That's right. So there you that's go. right. Yep. Yeah. Well, everything you're losing, I'm putting on. So. Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all have a great rest of the day answering the million text messages that you will now be receiving. So. Right. <laughs> Welcome yes, aboard. Guys. Thank you. Y'all have, have a, a wonderful day. week. See you. You too. Thanks so much, y'all.